In the name of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Professor Alfred Tolois is the chairperson of the Anglican Bishop of Northern Uganda and he is also the lead for this celebration. My public lecture. Went in to Mkani. Pien Wamiruni, Dano May Uganda. Dano May we love. Gunyang Gunge, the Archbishop Jana Nilum Enana. Archbishop Jana Nilum Utimungo Tijango, my period, my El Timo. Archbishop Jana Nilum Kiro Benini Ladeango, my Enu Nurubotwa. You are more, my Eno Bano. Mom, you want to be my me, what kill my me, what ye make it a yim. And I yet can look my well, Kiyobo Bore Matin. Where Dano, which are puny, which are young, which are mad to keep one yet before what I had any. Pian Abishop Jana in the home. Obeyu chalo tara, obeyu chalo ati kimo kani eno eno pemewa, obeyu chalo tara mu ati kani eno doga mok makani mok me Uganda mok me Africa piwilo bolo unyangwai. Many times we go to we where it is prayer, it is praise, it is worship, and it has not given us the opportunity. To have an in-house like this, I'm talking about January the home. January the home, we are now in the mall. So, a time like this, we are having this public lecture for the first time. And we believe and we hope we shall continue to progress and make it bigger and bigger. This big council in their city embraced and endorsed the event accordingly. We, the District Council, learned that St. Janani Lukum ever since was not honored in the local government council in Kikum District. The council decided to unveil its photo on the wall of Kikum District Council in its memory and honor. The motion was moved yesterday by the district chairperson LC5 himself and was seconded to be unveiled today respectively. The theme is United in Service and Growth. United in Service and Growth. There is need for unity within the church, but there is also need for unity within the elected leaders. This is something that we need to impress. I think deeply about this thing. Unity, service, and growth. The local government is not going to be able to do it. The government is not going to be able to do it. And now we want growth. That is how I want to interpret this. I thought about that. Let's work together. Let's love one another. Let's all work hard to ensure that they are actually not going to be able to do it. They are going to be able to do it. I happen as a young person, 
I think I was 10 years old or between 8 and 10 when I, I met uh, the late bishop. He was a frequent visit to my father's house and uh, as far as I was concerned, it meant nothing to me. He was just an uncle of mine, an auntie of mine who would come to visit our parents in Jija. Or sometimes we would come to visit uh, my parents would come and see him here uh, in, in Kampala. And it never even occurred to me how important eventually uh, this person would come at home and, uh, and, and uh, with his wife and my mother, la mera, la mera, la mera, la mera, where would you recall you? Where would you recall you? It never occurred to me at all. That was general room. To me, it was the little Khadija, the little Khadija. But I'm glad that God, God uh, brought me across his life.